That building there is Meze Berlin, or Messe Berlin, however you want to pronounce it. It means I'm back at IFA this year for 2025 to take a look at the latest and greatest technology. But the only problem is, I've been saying IFA all wrong. It's not called IFA, it's called IFA. But anyway, that's by the by. Let's go and take a look at some really cool technology because I'm so excited. Over the years, Bluetti have consistently been on all of my Christmas gift lists and prime discount lists and best tech lists. And that's because they make, in my opinion, some of the best mobile batteries that you can buy. And I'm not talking just tiny little power bricks. I'm talking gigantic power stations, as well as smaller stuff as well. But we'll get into that in just a second because I'm here to take a look at three new products they're releasing here at EFA 25. And there's a couple of them that's really quite exciting. And I'll start with what I think is the best. This. This is a very special product indeed. It's got a lot of the same design language as the other Bluetti ranges, except it's blue. And why is it blue? Well, because this is the world's first sodium ion portable battery. Now that is special because it brings a lot more capability for use in colder temperatures. Now you know that temperature affects battery life. I don't know if you've ever you've taken your phone out in the freezing cold before, but the battery drops significantly quicker and your usage out of products gets significantly less. Especially flying drones in the cold as well, I find that really runs out much faster. This is sodium iron inside it rather than lithium means that this can be used in temperatures up to minus 25 as far as I'm aware and it still be absolutely fine and that's minus 25 degrees not whatever the wrong calculation that Americans use. This is a really imperative product for people who use it in colder climates so if you are someone who needs a portable power station but you're camping in the middle of a blizzard this the world's first Sodium ion battery, Pioneer NA, which NA, NA is the element for sodium, is incredible. It's absolutely what we've needed for colder climates. And it's really cool to see this ingenuity built into this same form factor that we're really familiar with, with Bluetti products. And the best thing is, they haven't skimmed out. It's still got wireless charging. There we go. This is another product from Bluetti, and this was a bit of a surprise to me actually. This is something they're calling bridge power backup system. This is actually a very genius device that is an addition to your fridge that can sit either side of it or on top of it or underneath it if you've got one of those lifted off the floor. And it supplies power to your fridge when there's a cut off from the mains, which oddly happens more often than not at my house. But I love the idea of this. If you didn't have the capability or the money or the, or the ability to have a much larger home backup system, this is a small, simple solution that adds onto your existing fridge and just ensures that it's powered whilst being more inexpensive than some of the bigger options out there to keep your whole home powered. Because we all know how upset you'd be if that state in the fridge spoiled and lost some power very upset indeed. And I can't believe how thin this actually is. And it looks like there's a bunch of different ways of mounting it as well. This one's mounted to the wall like this. And then on here, you've got it sat above the fridge with the display showing exactly what sort of charge they've got. But this is a really interesting product. It's an awesome idea. And I think it definitely solves the problem if you want to keep that fridge. And thing is, it's not necessarily just for consumers. If you have a business, having something like this could mean the difference between an entire stock spoiled and an entire stock saved by having a backup battery. And one thing that is quite cool is it's modular and expandable. I believe that you can add expansion kits over and over again. So if you wanted to ensure that your fridge is powered for much longer periods of time, over longer periods of power cuts, then you can add more as needed. That is a very clever bit of 
This is the last product that Blue FC have released for EFA 2025, and it's this brand new RV setup, which essentially is a plug and play system for RVs, for boats, for camper vans. You could even use it in potentially something like a garden office, as an example. This here is the control panel, you've got the batteries, and this kind of is your fuse board or distribution panel for all of the stuff in whatever it is you're mounting it to. And then over here, we've got the control panel for it, which is awesome. It looks incredible, this thing. And then you've got that, which is the solar panels for the setup. This is an all-in-one, simple, plug-and-play setup, and I absolutely love it. It takes all of the calculations and worry and mess of having to faff about trying to work out some budged do-it-yourself scenario and it gives you everything plug and play pop it on off you go i've been looking for something like this myself i converted a camper van not too long ago and i actually forewent electrics because i couldn't be bothered trying to work out how to not kill myself with electric so the fact that now bluetti have given us a plug and play option that isn't going to destroy my camper van or set it on fire I think is awesome. So well done, Bluetti, with this release. What a fantastic design. Bang. So that is everything from Bluetti here at EFA 25. Awesome launches, and it's really great to see that they've tried to take problems that people have had with this type of technology and solve them, or even just problems that people have around the home and solve them with their new lineup. I love the fact that you've got that solution for RVs, it's literally plug and play, the Falco system, the charging solutions for charging in minus numbers in terms of temperature, and that fridge power. That is a really cool little innovation, and I think will really help a lot of people. If you don't want to have a massive power solution at home charging your entire house, have a small one for something like the fridge, which means that all of your produce and food doesn't go to waste if you ever have a power cut, which for some reason in Wales, I seem to have all the bloody time. But overall, awesome launches from Bluetti, and I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you want to check out Bluetti, I'll leave a link to their website in below, and also I'll leave a link to all of their eco content from SKU's reviews here in a playlist as well in the description. And if you're watching on television, scan that QR code with your phone, it'll take you to a playlist of all of our content as well. But other than that, that's enough from me from Bluetti, and I'm going to have a look and see what I can find, because we've still got a few hours left.